What up guys, so before we get into this video, I gotta give a huge shout out to Squarespace. If you guys are looking to build a website, make sure you use the promo code Richie Lee for 10% off your first website, all right? I'll talk about them a little bit later, but for now, let's get into these jackets. What's going on everybody? Today we are going to be showing you guys five cheaper alternatives to expensive trendy jackets. I made sure all the jackets are available to purchase right now, so links will be in the description box below. Enough talking though, let's get right into it. All right guys, so before we get into this first jacket, I just wanna let you guys know that all these jackets were hand selected by myself. This was not a sponsored video. They were not sent to me. I just wanted to get that out the way, but let's get into this first jacket. First jacket up for only 50 bucks, we got a cheaper alternative to a $1,500 Saint Laurent denim jacket. So if you look at the super expensive Saint Laurent version as seen on Joe Budden and a bunch of other celebrities, it actually features a corduroy collar just like this H&M version right here. So not only did they mimic the details of the collar, but they also got it all the way down to the denim wash as well. And you know we always say this in our videos, when it comes to products like these, where you can't really identify it based off of a logo, the brands do not matter, all right? $1,500 or $50, which one would you guys rather have? Overall, this is a very solid alternative to the Saint Laurent jacket. You're basically just trying to get the look of the corduroy collar down, which H&M did a really good job at. Let's move on to the next jacket. Next jacket up at only 59 bucks, we got a cheaper alternative to the Kith collaboration that they did with Montclair a few months ago. So if you guys are familiar with Montclair, they they are very iconic with using this color scheme when it comes to their jackets. And like I said earlier, they did a collaboration with Kith and those specific jackets are reaching well into the two to three thousand dollar range. One thing to keep in mind though, when it comes to Montclair jackets, a lot of people really like that shiny glossy look that the material has. This one does not have it. It kind of has like more of a matte material. So definitely keep this in mind if you are looking for this as a cheaper alternative. Even though this H&M jacket is significantly cheaper than the Kith Montclair one, it does feature some nice details. You've got a nice pull tab right here. You got this fleece lining unless you really need that Kith Montclair stamp on your arm I say just roll with this one next one up. We got another down jacket at 59 bucks We got a cheaper alternative to the $250 North Face 700 jacket. All right guys So right now in my hands I have the $250 North Face version and as you guys can see it is very similar to this $59 H&M version and just comparing the two jackets side by side right now I actually like the yellow on the H&M version more than the North Face one looking at them right now now. It's a little bit more vibrant, has a nice deep tone to it. I know it's probably hard to tell on camera, but in person right now, comparing the two yellows, I definitely prefer the H&M version. But obviously with the H&M version, you know, the technology is not going to be as good as the North Face. It's not going to be as warm. Um, you're not going to get the North Face branding, but as far as looks, you're definitely going to get that look. So the design does have a little bit of hype surrounding it, but if you don't want to pay for that hype, this ain't a bad route to go. Next jacket up, we got a cheaper alternative to a Canada Goose jacket. Canada Goose being almost a thousand bucks, and this one only 129. Canada Goose jackets, a lot of people really like the look of them, how warm they are and everything, but there's a lot of negative publicity that surrounds the brand itself. So not only are you gonna be saving a ton of money with this H&M version, you're also gonna be dodging all that negativity that comes with having that patch on your arm. Long story short, a lot of people didn't really like how they were doing their geese dirty, which is how they source their down feathers for inside of their jackets. But if you made me guess, this H&M version doesn't even have real feathers, so you don't even have to worry about that. Overall, just by filling this material, you're gonna be able to stay warm. They also had a couple other variations that utilize some other materials as well. All worth checking out. Let's move on to the last jacket. Last but not least, at only 49 nine bucks we got a cheaper alternative to Ralph Lauren's very popular stadium series little bit of background information the stadium series by Ralph Lauren was super popular in the 90s and recently they just retroed a limited quantity of some jackets and shirts and they completely sold out a lot of rappers are always referencing the stadium series and it is actually sought after by a lot of Ralph Lauren connoisseurs and collectors basically what I'm trying to say it is a very sought after design but if you're not trying to spend thousands of dollars on the real thing well here you go a cheaper alternative Obviously, you're not gonna get that exact Ralph Lauren braining or the quality or even the points, but you're pretty much gonna get the same vibe. So basically, if you're just trying to get into that whole Ralph Lauren Stadium series, it can get pretty costly. So this is not a bad intro if you're just trying to try out the look. All right, guys, thank you for checking out that five cheaper alternatives to expensive trendy jackets. Let me know down in the comments below if you guys want any more of these or if there's any other types of products that you guys want me to cover. And that's pretty much it. Make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel. And until next time, I'm out. Peace. All right, guys, thank you for checking out that video. Right now, we are just fulfilling some orders for the Richie Lee collection. We are at the warehouse right now. 
But like I said earlier, man, huge shout out to Squarespace for sponsoring this video right here. If you guys are looking to build a website, make sure you use the promo code Richie Lee, all right, for 10% off your first website. And you know, I always say this in my videos, if it is one thing that you could really utilize when you're trying to uh, meet someone for the first time and you're trying to network and everything, it is a legit website. I have absolutely no HTML background or history and I was able to build a website on Squarespace. And also, if there's anybody out there working on some cool projects that they're trying to market, let me know down in the comments below and maybe we'll shout them out in the next vlog. Maybe you're a photographer, maybe you're working on a YouTube channel and also shout out your website if you have made it on squarespace.com. And that's pretty much it and until next time, I'm out. Peace. All right, guys, thank you for checking out this video. Make sure you guys hit that thumbs up and like the video. Make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel. Like I said, we are trying to hit a million as soon as we can. And that's pretty much it. And until next time, I'm out. Peace.